Welcome to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show, where you get advice you can trust from the Capital Region's leading experts in real estate and all related fields. From the latest real estate trends to the best mortgage rates, from curb appeal to home warranty, this is the talk show that will help you save and make the most when it comes to buying or selling your most valuable asset. Now, here's your host, broker and founder of Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty, the property shop, John Bevilacqua. Good morning. Wow. Johnny G, we're doing, we're, we're we're pulling it off, man. Hey, I got to tell you, I got to tell you before we go any further. Go for it, Joe Malone. Joe Malone, he job nailed last it. Week. Did he call me John Bellavacqua or did he get he it did, right? But he got it right at the end of the show. <laughs> it only took him a half hour to pronounce my name. I've known the guy almost ten years. A great guy, but he did a great job. I listened to the show. He kicked he 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 kicked butt, man. I'm proud of him. Yeah. I'm proud of him. That that's good. It gives me some flexibility to have uh, another anchor take over the show. We actually got another agent. Um, one of my agents is coming on next Saturday. Good. Uh, Tracy Robbins. She's she's Sorry. she's gonna be a good uh, good guest yep. slash uh, co host. But we've got a a spe- Johnny. I listen before well, we we get yeah. Sean Moody on the phone. Right? I, were you not up last night watching the Yankee game? Of course I oh was. My God. It's, you know, it's and, not and I'm going, all right, I don't want better. this to turn into ESPN radio, but oh <laughs> yeah. my God, I got to talk to another Yankee fan about oh, this. Oh man, I'm telling you, it was something else. It really oh. was. And you know, it was it was like the, the night before the game they lost. It's like okay, they've got this pitching's got to take it to the end, and right. didn't happen. And and again, last night, you know, Cleveland comes back, tie the game, ties six, it six. up. It was like, here we go again. That Naylor you know, guy. I can't and, stand and, him oh, after yeah, the, no. the carrying the baby incident. Like, I have no fingernails left. I, uh, I literally, yeah, and I yeah. must have paced like but, a hole I mean, in my That carpet. is a good game. Uh, I mean, it really is. Woo. Exciting to watch. And uh, 8-6 Yankees, they yeah. now lead the series three games to one. We'll yep. see what happens tonight. We'll see what happens. So, all right. So, let, let's, let's get off the Let's see if we can get Yanks. Sean Moody on let's the Let's get Sean on sure it works. Yep. So, Sean, are you with us? Okay. There we go. Sean, are you there? Good morning. There he is. Ah, there we are. Okay. There he is. What's... I just wanted to check to make sure everything was a okay. What? What's up, Sean? <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> I wish I could say you're in in in, a, in sunnier climes, but you're well. It's actually sunny here, but you're still here, right in upstate New York, not that far away. Absolutely. What's up, my man? So, so Sean and I put together what we think is is kind of the continuation. So, Sean, if you guys. Don't know who he is at this point. He's been on the show many times. He's our credit credit expert, uh, alternative real estate financing expert, and we we you know Sean put out a book about I don't know it's been like a year now Sean since you put the book out. Absolutely, yep. It's the perfect formula uh, for business credit. That's the name of the book, and we've talked about you know kind of we've made his appearances kind of a series on you know step by step how to do this. And we're we're kind of at the next layer here, and Sean and I are going to get in, into using lines of credit, credit cards, uh, financial tools to do this. But we got to take a quick sponsor break, uh, Sean, and when we get back, we're going to get right into it. Uh, to schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. It's John Tesh. If you're thinking of selling your home, let me take the stress out of deciding which agent to hire. In the Capital Region, the agent I recommend is John Bevilacqua, founder of Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty at the Property Shop. So for two decades, John has helped more than 2,500 families buy and sell the place they call home. That's a solid track record, one that's backed up by dozens of five-star reviews. Hello. In fact, John is so confident in his marketing system to attract the right buyer for your home that he guarantees to sell it at a price and deadline you agreed to or he's going to buy it himself for cash. And he provides that guarantee in writing. The agent I trust is John Bevilacqua, and he's the agent you should trust too. His name is his promise, Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty. So write this number down. It's 518-957-SOLD. That's easy. 518-957-7653. Or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com I love that one johnnyhasthebuyers.com and you'll get your home sold guaranteed Hi, I'm Matt Moore from Moore Insurance Services in Clifton Park Let me take the stress out of quoting your home and auto insurance We represent over 10 companies which allows us to find the best coverage at the best prices We've been helping families in the Capital District save money on their insurance for over 10 years You can count on a quick turnaround as well as great communication every time Give me a call at 518 518- 
1452 or go online to moreinsurancesvc.com and experience the difference. That's moreinsurancesvc.com. Buying or selling the place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast, respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at salernolawny.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. Okay, guys, we're back. We got uh, we got Sean Moody here. Uh, resident credit expert calling into the show. We got a great show for you guys today. Um, you know, we last, last show, Sean, we, we really hit on the, um, we really hit on the, the whole legal credit aspect, right? Like letting people know, Hey, you have credit rights. This isn't just something where, uh, the credit bureaus can mess with you, make your credit life, uh, you know, hell, so to speak. And y- you can do something about it, you know, Sean, right? Absolutely, absolutely. We, we're all, as consumers, all of us have our rights under the Fair Credit Reporting Act. And these bureaus, again, they're not government agencies. They are actually private, for-profit companies. So, and they make mistakes. That's the reality. So, absolutely, they do make mistakes, and 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 they can be, you know, taken to Judge Wapner if need be to 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 get those mistakes state uh, mistakes corrected. But this week, uh, we're really trying to turn the page on. The process that we've, you know, brought the listeners through over the past few shows, which was, yeah, you know, getting business credit established, right? And if you're going to buy property, you're going to you're going to get an investment real estate, do a fix and flip, uh, buy a you know a four unit property, buy a, a single family home as a rental. Establishing business credit is paramount, right? You don't want to do this on your own credit, correct, Sean? Absolutely, absolutely. You know, if you're doing any business, especially a real estate. Uh, you be, you're an investor, you got to treat it as a business because it really is a business, right? You're, you're doing it for investment purposes. And so you want to separate your personal finances from the, from your business finances. So that is critical. That's, that's the foundation of really being able to protect yourself as well as, uh, you know, grow your portfolio the right way. Right. So you're, you're establishing business credit, you're establishing an LLC, you're going to set up an LLC for yourself. So you can get uh, a federal EIN number. That can be linked to Dun and Brad Streets. It could be linked to Experian, and start to build your credit profile and start to you know go from a thin file, as they say, right, Sean, to a fat file that shows that you have uh, established credit lines. You've bought some products on a thirty day. Um, what do they call it? Thirty day. Um, yeah, so it's uh, uh, it, it invoice. Yeah, so so they call them net thirties. Net thirties. That's right. Correct. Yep. yep. So you're paying net 30s and you're starting to establish yourself business credit. Now, once you've gotten through this layer, Sean, there's oper- there's doors open for you, correct? Now, tell us about what opens up once you're starting to establish your business credit that can help you purchase properties. Absolutely. Thanks again for having me, John. Oh, yeah. So um, it takes the average small business owner. I'm glad owner. you made it on the call in today, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it takes the average small business owner anywhere between a year to a year and a half to establish a full business credit profile, what you just uh, articulated. Now, the, the challenge is, you know, only 10% of the lenders and banks actually report to the business credit bureau. So you got to know who to work with, um, right, and, and who reports to the, to the business credit bureaus. And so um, not a shameless plug, but the, the book will tell you exactly you can Google us, obviously, but the book, we, we're very detailed about how you can do that. But to your point, yes, that is going to be the foundation. And why do you want established business credit? Well, as I mentioned earlier, you want to separate your business uh, expenses from the personal expenses. Secondly, when you're taking on um, debt, good debt, meaning you're making an investment, you don't want that showing up on your personal credit report, right? Because that's going to not only affect your personal credit score, but it's also going to make you look over leveraged to the banks when you're looking to make a personal purchase, whether it's your, your personal home or you're buying a personal vehicle, right? So you want to separate that. So the foundation is building the business credit. Once you do that, now you're going to have access to higher terms, um, better, excuse me, better terms, higher limits, right? And so think about it. Think about the highest credit card you may have in your wallet, your purse. Times that by 10. Right. 
that is that is the, the the benefit of establishing business credit. And the reality is, especially for um, investors, a lot of them may use um, well, some of them use traditional banks. You know, I've I've gone to a traditional bank, but I've also used private lenders. But ultimately, what if you had the option to be your own, be the bank? You can be your own your own lender, That's meaning right. you have access to credit, so that when you need it, when that opportunity comes up, that that hot deal comes up. You don't have to, you know, go through hoops and circles to get funding. You've got the funding available, readily available to you, whether it's a down payment or it might be the, the entire purchase, depending on what you're looking for. But the bottom line is you have more leverage being that you've already set yourself up as the bank. And by establishing business credit, you can do that. And it, I know I know it's it's I don't want to make this the focus, but once you have that business credit established, like you helped me through the process you get sent cards, credit cards, and and most people think, oh, you know, credit cards. Uh, you know, we buy purses with that. Uh, you know, groceries, furniture, but they don't send you the run of a mill run of the mill credit card like you would as if you accepted one of those Discover cards that come in the mail. Right? You maybe get a credit line of like twenty five hundred bucks, five thousand. They're sending you credit credit lines of twenty five grand, thirty grand. Correct, Sean? Absolutely, it's twenty grand, thirty grand, fifty grand, fifty grand. Right. right. These are big so, cards. Absolutely. And it's called capital stacking. So look, think of it as uh, multiple business lines of credit. So, uh, again, if you get a, a, traditional, a traditional line of credit or even a, a business credit card, and, again, remember, these are not reporting to your personal credit report. That's huge. You only pay what you use, and that's huge. Because if you take, a, if you take a, a loan, you're going to start making payments immediately. Whereas if you have a line of credit or a business credit card, to your point, point, John, you, pay, you only pay when you use it. So if I don't need the, the capital right now, I don't use it. And guess what? I don't make payments. And another huge point, in addition to the the, um, the high limits, you're getting 0% introduction rates. And it can be anywhere from 12 to 18 months, sometimes even 24 months. Right? So imagine having access to 0% lending. Right. Where you can deploy that money to go out and bring you back more money. Right? That's That's the goal. All right. So with that being said, like, how do you, you know, you can't. You can't go to the attorney's office and swipe a card and buy a house, right? So how, like, how do you use this money? Like, how, how do you get the money off the cards? Like, what's the strategy here? Yeah, so one of the hot topics I've, I've uh, discussed with clients and friends over the years is, is credit to cash, right? How do you convert credit to cash? Because if you truly want to be the bank, at, certain, at a certain point, you're going to have to figure out strategies how to do that. So there's three different ways you can convert, uh, um, three typical ways that you can convert credit to cash. One is a, a balance transfer. Now, a balance transfer can be very, very expensive, right? The average transfer fee is anywhere between 3 to 5%, and then the interest rate on that's going to be anywhere between 18 to 30%. Very expensive. I wouldn't do that. Option B, there's companies out there that can actually convert that credit card uh, to cash for you. So, example, uh, and I've done this personally, uh, you're working on a project, you've you just bought an investment property, and you've got some... Um, work, you know, construction people in there uh, doing the rehab work, and they don't take credit cards, by the way. Well, there's a company called Plastique, as an example, where you can you can pay invoices as long as, as, long as the construction company sends you an invoice. You can pay uh, with a credit card, and they're going to charge you a 2.9% uh, success fee, which is, nothing. to me, the price of doing business, right? That's nothing. Um, so that's another option. And so as long as you get an invoice, a company like Plastique, you know, they don't, even if they don't take uh, traditional credit cards, you can you can go ahead and, and uh, make that quote unquote cash purchase. So right? so so you're flipping a house and the hardwood floor guys come in and and buff and glow the floors, sand them down, and they're like, okay, Mister Bevelock, well you owe us eight grand, and uh, here's your receipt, and you're like, okay, I don't have any cash, but I can I can use plastique, right? You can use that. Per you you can use you can tap those credit cards since these guys don't take cards; they're usually cash guys. And and absolutely, and use that to your advantage to pay for 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 contractor bills. Absolutely. So again, put yourself in again. Let's let's take a step back and look at the scenario. So you've got established business credit. Yep. So you've got high limit credit cards. Many of them at zero percent interest for an introductory period. And now you have the opportunity to 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 liquidate those business lines of credit as little as zero. So you know as little as two point nine percent, and at a zero percent interest rate. Right. I mean, you're not going to get cheaper money than that. No way. I mean, go, go, go get, go get a traditional line that. of credit. I have traditional business lines of credit. You're not going to get one at zero percent. Well, listen, Sean, we're coming up on the break here. Um, 
the, there's there's some moody magic that I want to get to in terms of item line item number three, converting these cards into cash. We're going to take a quick break. We're going to hear that strategy and then talk about we're going to talk about some of the benefits and also some of the risks with this with, with using this type of money. Um, not that they're big ones, but they're, they're definitely worth talking about. Stay tuned, guys. Coming up after the break, we have Sean Moody at, on the Your Home Soul Guaranteed Radio Real Estate Talk Show. To schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guarantee Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. Hi, I'm Matt Moore from Moore Insurance Services in Clifton Park. Let me take the stress out of quoting your home and auto insurance. We represent over 10 companies, which allows us to find the best coverage at the best prices. We've been helping families in the Capital District save money on their insurance for over 10 years. You can count on a quick turnaround as well as great communication every time. Give me a call at 518-280-1452 or go online to moreinsurancesvc.com and experience the difference. That's moreinsurancesvc.com. Buying or selling the place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast, respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at SalernoLawNY.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to JohnnyHasTheBuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. All right, guys, thanks for sticking with us. As I mentioned, I promise you guys we're going to give you some insight and, and really use Sean's techniques to, and Sean Moody, by the way, is our resident credit and alternative finding expert for Moody Blues Consulting. Uh, Sean is, uh, you know, been on the show many a times. He's, he's really given us some, you know, kind of a blueprint here as real estate investors to, to tap business, business credit and use it to your advantage to use as a, a down payment on, on the purchase of a home, use it as reconstruction and renovation money on a on a flip house there's so many ways you can use sean's money it's like every time we get on the show we just barely scratch the surface but um yeah sean you still there i just want to make sure sean's calling in today so yes sir he is it's man i I miss having you i'm I'm looking at your chair sean and and you're not there man (laughs) you know but i know i know but you're here in spirit and you're here on the phone so that's all that really matters buddy so hey listen i do want to talk quickly about our vip homeowner service because sean's got the money to get folks into investment properties but the challenge right now in this market is finding them right i mean sean you you know the market's still tight right Yes, I do. Yeah, man, it's it's uh, it's slim pickings out there. We've had no mercy on interest rates over the past twelve months, and we had a half a point decrease on the Fed, which was, I mean, that was a joke. But you know, it did stimulate some stuff, a little refinance action, and you know, maybe a couple extra purchases here or there. But it it, it definitely has not helped us with the inventory problem. That's not only. A national shortage, but you know, definitely a, a shortage in upstate New York. There's just not enough properties for people to buy, especially in, in uh, on the investment arena. So, so the VIP homeowner service that we offer gives our clients access to off market properties, bank foreclosures, company owns, basically the stuff that doesn't make it to Zillow, doesn't make it to the big syndicators, and quite frankly, it doesn't even really make it past my desk because. Those type of deals get snatched up by people that are on this VIP homeowner service or are working with me directly. So if you want to learn more about how the service works and become one of our preferred buyers, give us a call, 957-SOLD, 957-7653. We want to work with you uh, and and find these uh, these these hard-to-get properties. So with that being said, Sean, let's, let's keep the conversation going and talk a little bit about some of the benefits and the risks of using these uh these these low interest credit cards these lines of credit i mean hey let's think about this sean you get these cards and a lot of them have travel rewards like cash off you know uh, cash back bonuses like is that not a good situation it's an, it's an amazing situation because again you're using these you're using these cards 
um, and, or these lines of credit consistently for business purposes, right? Because it, 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 your expenses are, are your expenses. So you want to be able to, um, you know, responsibly be able to pay your expenses, but also benefit as much as you can. And, and by the way, um, interest paid on a, um, on a credit card for business purposes is tax deductible. Great point. So there's, there's, there's a ton of, of benefits, uh, to business owners and, and investors. I didn't even think about that angle. That is a great tax write off is the interest on that. Um, so I mean, not only that, you, this, we're talking about immediate access to funds, right, Sean? Like this isn't something you're waiting on. Yes. So the, the other, uh, we mentioned three different uh, ways. So the, the third way I didn't mention is, so I actually am part of Oh, that's right. I forgot course. about the Moody Magic. My, my, thank you yeah. for reminding me, Sean. <laughs> I don't know if I call it Moody Magic, but we'll, we'll go with that. It sounds good. Um, let's go anyway, with it. Come on. But anyway, um, yeah, so I'm part of with financial uh, professionals that can actually uh, wire money directly from those lines of credit in the way of credit cards right into your bank account if needed. And it can do it anywhere between five to, to ten, excuse me, five to ten business days. And the cost for that is anywhere between uh, four and a half to six percent. So there is there is a cost there. But again, imagine uh, being able to do that um, on a zero percent interest um, card that you have uh, to, to make a purchase uh, or to close a deal or to do a rehab work. Again, you become the bank. And the main thing is you have a plan to pay yourself back, whether you're flipping the property or you plan to do a cash out refi, whatever the case may be. As long as you have a plan, you can be the bank and you have cash so you can get access to cash directly into your into your business bank account. So it, it's a game changer. And I've had a number of clients that, that have taken advantage of it. As a matter of fact, I have a teacher who uh, bought his first investment property and used, used uh, business funding for part of his down payment. So it, it can be useful. And that's a great example, though, Sean, because this isn't for the advanced real estate investors, teachers, uh, you know, uh, any just regular people that are are you know carrying nine to five jobs that want to start getting into this business can do all this like this isn't complicated stuff honestly like john if you read the book and sean's book is it's not long it's not long it, it's <laughs> it, it's it, it it gets to the point it's it's a yep. quick read it's what you need and it's what you need it, yeah. it's literally like prime ex- you go through the book you know the first two chapters are more um about the actual process and then it's just references sean just gives you all the places where you need to go all the websites the links and it's boom all right tell us uh sean your book title and where it's available always have to do that you know good point <laughs> absolutely so so um, doing birth, excuse me business perfect com is the is the web is the website yep business perfect com. Your book name? And, um, oh, sorry, uh, uh, <laughs> sorry. Perfect business credit. Perfect uh, business and personal credit. The perfect formula for business credit. And perfect, perfect formula for business credit. Yeah, I'm sorry, cheating. Okay. I'm cheating because I have it written down, Sean. Yeah. But yes, and um, it's go right to the website. That's where you get the book. So at the at the end of the day, um, right? And it's it's a quick download. So. You know, th- also other benefits, and I want to get into the risk of it because I don't want this to be completely sunshine and rainbows here. Because you know, there's there's risk to everything. It's an investment, so this isn't uh, you know there 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 could be some you know some turbulence here, so to speak. But when you're doing all this, you're also strengthening your personal and business credit on top of all this, right? So it's quick access to funds, um, cheap ways to strip you know to strip the money off the cards or the lines of credit, and you're building the personal credit, but. This can it can get unnerving, right? You you know, let's say you got a hundred thousand uh, dollar line of credit here, and you know the the introductory rate runs out, and you're looking at you know twenty five percent interest after the introductory rate runs out. Sean, like, what can you do to kind of hedge the risk here? Yeah, so there's a couple different options. One is, and, and again, you have to be very. The first thing to your point, you want to be disciplined. And you want to have a plan. And that's with using any credit, whether you're using business credit, personal credit, personal loan, business loan, credit cards. You want to have a plan, right? You can't spend $100 and you have, and you have $20, right? You have to have a plan. Um, having said that, yes. Um, so one of the things you can do, and I've done as well, is you can do a, a balance transfer, right? To a, so let's say you have, let's say you've put $30,000 on a 0% interest credit card and it's, it's about to expire. Okay. You can you can transfer you can do a balance transfer 
on the business side to another car that, that that's currently at zero percent as well. And you'll get by the way, you'll get offers. <laughs> you'll get <laughs> you offers. Right. You'll get offers. That's a good point because at that point your 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 business credit's established and they're just going to keep sending you stuff. Correct. Correct. Now again, you don't. Um, you want to be. I, I keep underlining this, this this fact. You want to be responsible. It's not free money. Um, but if you've got a plan, um, again, you can essentially become the bank. All right, we're going to talk about that plan, Sean, because you're not in the studio here. John's like flagging me down. We got to take a quick sponsor break. We're going to talk about the plan and mitigating risk on this on this credit method after the break. To schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guarantee Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. Buying or selling the place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at salernolawny.com. Hi, I'm Matt Moore from Moore Insurance Services in Clifton Park. Let me take the stress out of quoting your home and auto insurance. We represent over 10 companies, which allows us to find the best coverage at the best prices. We've been helping families in the Capital District save money on their insurance for over 10 years. You can count on a quick turnaround as well as great communication every time. Give me a call at 518-280-1452 or go online to moreinsurancesvc.com and experience the difference. That's moreinsurancesvc.com. Buying or selling a place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast, respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at salernolawny.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. All right, guys, we're back. We got Sean Moody in the hot chair today. From Moody Blues Consulting, talking about tapping business credit to buy real estate and utilizing investor strategies to get in the game and buy a flip house, buy a two family, buy something, buy real estate because it's not going to get any cheaper, right, Johnny? It just keeps going up and up and up, oh, yeah. and they're not making any more of it. That's the old adage in real estate. So, Sean, um, we were talking about kind of mitigating the risk. And I, I want to talk about the plan a little bit more because it's not only the plan on the yeah, financing you got that you've got. one minute. we got one minute. <laughs> it's having a plan with the financing, but also having a plan with the real estate, right? And know what you're buying and figure out what the plan is it, it, ahead of time. And really, right. that's just working with experts, working with, with guys like us, um, having Sean on your side, having me on your side for the purchase of the real estate. Uh, and, and that's, that's really the key. That's the key to the success. It doesn't have to be scary. It doesn't have to be too turbulent. I'm not going to say it's going to be easy, right? There's going to be some, some grind to it, but it, the juice is always worth the squeeze, as I say. Um, Sean, any last comments here? Cause we have one minute that, uh, you want to talk about on, on the credit side. Yeah, I apologize, I apologize. But yeah, um, so look, at the end of the day, uh, investors have, I just want investors to, to know that they have other options in the way of alternative financing and they don't have to. Uh, be beholden to traditional banks. Not to say that that's a, that's a bad thing, but especially when you're first starting out, as, you know, a part-time investor, uh, there are ways for you to get access to capital responsibly, where you can you can start to build your portfolio. Um, the other thing I, I would I would say is, you know, once you build that business credit, that's which it. Would be paramount, um, then you're going to get more opportunities, not with just. Uh, alternative lenders, but with traditional banks. They're looking for business credit, established business credit as well. So I'll, I'll turn it back over to you, John. Thanks, buddy. Sean, listen, thanks for coming on the show. We appreciate it, man. Uh, we made it to the end. 54321. Thank you, guys. Have a great Saturday. <laughs>
The Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show is presented by Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty, the property shop. Join broker and founder John Bevilacqua every Saturday morning at 830 to hear about the latest real estate trends here in the Capital Region, where to find the best mortgage rates, home insurance, home warranties, and more. To speak to John about buying or selling your home, call now to schedule an appointment. 518-957-SOLD. That's 518-957-7653. Or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. That's johnnyhasthebuyers.com. 